So Chelsea, first game of this season under the belt, 2-0 loss to Nosama. An excellent performance from the team though, especially considering how short-handed you were. You know, yeah, I think going into this, one of the biggest messages with the group was shorthanded or not, 11 players on the pitch and every 11 player needs to show up. So of the players that uh, we had for this match and going in, we had a plan and they committed and honestly, it was uh, refreshing and just exciting to see them battle together and gel together so quickly. Defensively, some amazing performances out there today and considering that you don't have maybe your, your what you'd think of as you're starting back line there, but I mean, they were just blocking everything and putting their bodies on the line. Yeah, and you know what? And those are the players that make my life miserable because that's a good team. That's a great team. They're fit, they're strong, they're fast. They've got good organization going forward. Um, and they handled it as if it was something they were familiar with. The players showed up big, yeah. At the other end of the pitch, I thought Virk was outstanding out there. She just put in a, an amazing shift. Talk about this team offensively that we're going to see in the future sort of weeks because it's a long season. You just need to finish top four right now to get into the playoffs. Is that kind of the message to the team? Just keep doing it. What can we expect from the team? You'll see definitely our true TSS Rovers DNA. Like we have a certain way that we like to play, but then also uh, you have a lot of players that are incredibly intelligent on the ball and uh, creative in, in that attack mindset. So there's going to be a lot more um, threats in behind lines. There's going to be a lot more surprises, I would say, just in the individual efforts. Um, but then also, just like you saw today, the, the camaraderie in twos or threes and moving forward with the cohesiveness uh, is something that we have been working hard on and we hope to continue moving forward with. Uh, just last thing, second year as head coach of this team, what have you learned about yourself from year one to year two? I would say that the players will always surprise you and that's my favorite thing. There's times going into these games that you do only so much, uh, but at the end of the day, best and trust and, and really believe in these players and I have yet to be let down in this group and yet to be let down by any of the players. They are phenomenal and full of surprises and that's my favorite thing about this job. Okay, thanks so much Chelsea and good luck next week.